Bible is saying, Whom shall he teach knowledge? Whom shall he make to understand doctrine? The word translated knowledge there is not the type that you can get in the library. The word translated knowledge there symbolizes the kind of knowledge you can acquire only by revelation. That knowledge has the capacity to add life to your years. Somebody prayed and said, God add years to my life. That means he's saying, make me live long. I need 120 years to walk the world. But the point is this. 120 years will still be a waste if it's not in line with the force and the potency that drives from eternity. A man can live for five years, but the effect of that five years travels throughout time. A man can live for 20 years, and what he did in 20 years was able to establish a covenant with God that is eternal. So I would rather pray, Lord, add life to my years than ask God to add years to my life. How many years did Benson in Idahosa live? How many years did Babalola live? E.W. Kenyon wrote a book. When he wrote the book, he said this revelation was supposed to hit the body of Christ 400 years before God gave him that revelation. He was taught doctrine. Kenneth Hagin only came to South Africa. That was the only African country he came and he came once. Put his messages in print. That's what discipled almost all the major pastors in Africa. Wasmani wrote a book in 1929. I picked the book in 1994. It was breathing fire. Those were men that life was added to what? To their years. There are some people I, I saw in Lagos. Death would have been a blessing to me. It's not more time we need. More time will make us old. More time will bring age. Somebody pray and say, Lord, add life to my years.